P. V. Krishnamurti. I'm mentioning his name because P. V. Krishnamurti was one of the relatives of Karnam Subama. He and his brother-in-law, his name is D. N. Krishnamurti. These two were the people who built the Naga Shrine you see opposite the Ganesh Mandir today. Swami would take a small lamp and come walking all the way to Subama's house just to see them and you know see if all of them are settled. So P. V. Krishnamurti's mother, she had prepared the food. There was some sambar rice and curd rice. So she made all the children and grandchildren sit around, and she was putting a morsel of food in each one of their hands. Right? This is a very common sight in some of our Indian families. So there was this family dinner going on, and Swami would come, and Swami would see this sight. It's all dark. So Swami would put off the lamp and sneak into that crowd, into that small group, and he would put his hand. and he would eat and suddenly the mother would hear ah today food is very nice in a different voice and when she looks up it will be swami who will be laughing or sometimes when she is giving food somebody will hold swami <laughs> hold the mother's hand tightly and she'll wonder who is this boy who is doing like this and then swami would laugh out aloud or sometimes when people are cooking food dinner swami would sneak behind and close their eyes from behind you know many of these little things which are very common in families but swami did not merely say chuttalu because he was behaving like that these were the people who belonged to swami and after this after they complete their dinner in this manner it was time to sleep in the patha mandiram the beautiful thing was swami was everything so when everybody would go to bed swami would take a torch and he would go around why to see if there are any snakes and scorpions because they used to live with the snakes and scorpions around so swami would go around to ensure that none of these creatures are coming close by and that was another miracle which the devotees had noticed that there were so many of these creatures around but not once a devotee had a complaint of i had a snake bite i had a scorpion bite